So today we got the Tamron A057 150-500mm to 500 mm Super Telephoto lens with us exclusively designed for the Sony E-mount full frame camera. This video is going to be action packed so watch right till the end. If you want to see the unboxing of this lens, I have the link right up here. As a wildlife photographer and a street photographer, this lens is surely going to be a companion. Talking about the focal length, the model A057 has a zoom range of 150mm to 500mm on a full frame camera and 225mm to 750mm on a crop sensor. The aperture is also pretty good. At 5 to 6.7, you get a beautiful depth of field. It has a nice dull matte finish. The lens exterior is made of engineered plastic and metal having a very good build quality and also has a moisture resistant construction. The rubberized ring on the lens prevents dust and water splashes from entering the body and the lens. The filter size of the lens is 82mm. Now talking about the focusing feature of the lens. The autofocus drive mechanism is fortified with a high speed, high precision linear motor focus mechanism which is a VXD voice coil extreme torque drive. This ensures very fast, quiet and accurate shooting experience and responsive autofocus. The lens has a minimum object distance of 0.6mm which is 23.6inch at 150mm at 500mm, the MOD is 1.8 or 70.9 inch, which is again good for close up or nearby objects. Now, moving on to the vibration compensation, the lens has inbuilt vibration compensation, which allows the user to shoot handheld at lower shutter speed and yet capture sharp images. We have three VC incorporated. The mode one is the standard mode. Mode 2 exclusively for panning and Mode 3 for framing priority. Now talking about the size of the lens, it is pretty compact. It weighs 1725 grams without the tripod mount and with the tripod mount, it weighs 1880 grams. Lens dimensions are 93 mm by 209.6 mm minus the lens collar. The zoom ring is approximately 65 mm wide and is rubberized for a better grip. Has a clear focal length marking at 150, 200, 250, 300, 400 and 500 mm. Zoom has a lock at 150 mm to prevent any damage during travel. Focus ring towards the camera body is approximately 11 mm wide and is also rubberized for a better grip. A focus limiter switch 3m infinity and 15m infinity helps to acquire quicker focus. Autofocus and manual focus switch is provided to toggle in between both the focusing modes. The flex zoom lock is one of my favorite feature on the lens. The zoom ring has a push-pull design. At time when you're shooting at a focal length, say of 300mm or any other focal length for that matter, you need to merely push the zoom ring forward. This will lock the focal length setting. You will notice a white ring around the lens indicating that the focal length setting is locked. Pull the zoom rings toward you to unlock the zoom setting. With fluorine coating, the lens performs well in every weather condition. The front surface of the lens element is coated with a protective fluorine compound to repel water and oil. The tripod mount is like a highlight in the lens. It's sturdy and comes with the Arca Swiss type fitting to quickly and easily mount, dismount the lens from the tripod which is fitted with a compatible head. When shooting handheld, the tripod mount comes in the way of good hand holding. It can be taken off and will reduce the weight by approximately 155 grams. The lens comes with a special broadband 
anti reflection generation 2 coating which is applied on lens element surfaces to reduce flares and ghosting to deliver sharp crisp high contrast images under difficult lighting conditions the optical construction features 25 elements in 12 groups that include 1x xld extra low dispersion 2x hybrid aspherical and 5x ld which is a low dispersion element to correct for various potential lens aberrations so it's now time to put the lens into action and see what photograph we get in the real life condition i am very excited to show you the results So with me I have Shushil sir he is a award winning wildlife photographer he has been testing the lens along with me because he is the guy who's been doing a lot of wildlife photography so I brought him along so you have been uh, shooting them few pictures since morning <laughs> what is your experience about the lens so one I am very happy with the lens for multiple things one it is such a versatile lens mainly because the focal length it provides it's 150 to 500 which is good for mammals which is also good for uh, birds so that is the versatility of the lens i love how light the lens is uh, there are few features that i particularly like which is how fast it is the motor is super fast like right now we shot montegoos harrier in flight and got some crisp shots there so super happy with that i also like this new feature which is the zoom yeah the zoom flex because uh, at times what happens is we forget where we've locked the previous uh, focal length at and in a hurry in wildlife because nothing is in our control uh, animals suddenly appear and we suddenly click and the lens has moved or someone else has moved the focal length that doesn't happen and i love it we've been shooting handheld shots the entire day and we've been getting some stunners today i'm pretty pretty happy with this lens and i love the focal length diversity it has so that was from the man who shoot wildlife himself his first hand experience with the lens we have traveled extensively into the wild the whole day and it was a fantastic experience shooting with this lens we have showed you the results please do subscribe because it really means a lot to us about the performance of the lens i noticed a sweet spot anywhere between f8 to f11 depending upon the focal length however i did not notice any kind of chromatic aberrations in the images now what could have been better i really wish that the lens is available for other mount as well it has a filter size of 82 mm which is quite an unusual size also at f5 it is a slightly slower lens it's a bit heavy to carry around but also it is made of engineered plastic and metal and making it a strong and a sturdy lens many of you asked me what is the 150 600 lens made by tamron that is basically for the dslr model and this lens the 150 500 mm is made for the mirrorless cameras to sum it up the lens has a compact design it has a overall excellent performance very sharp images with good contrast and color saturation price at just 120900 it is value for money having the arca swiss tripod mount makes it very convenient to use in the description below i'm going to give you a link where you can go and check the specs of the lens and also its pricing we also reviewed the tamron f2.8 1770 lens earlier go check that now